Hey, this is King of the Universe 2, and in this tutorial I'll show you how to get Flash games onto your PSP. First thing you need to do is get Mozilla Firefox. Once you've done that, you go onto your PSP and make sure that Flash is enabled. You go to System Settings and then Enable Flash Player. When it is enabled, you go to a website that has Flash games. A good example is Miniclub. Once you're there, you search for a game, or you find the game, and you make sure that the game isn't too big, because if it's too big, it won't work. I'm using Snowline as an example. Once this is loaded, you go to File, and then Save Page As. Or you can simply click Control S. Then you go and you see that you have a link and a folder. All you need is the folder. Open up the folder and you look for a shockwave flash object that's named the name of the game. In this case, it's Snowline. Now you make sure that your PSP is connected to your computer. Then go and view the files to view the files of your PSP. And in other tutorials, people will tell you that you put the shockwave flash object in the root of the memory stick. But since I have PSP on me, offline launcher, you can make it easier by putting it into the PSP common section. To make it even easier, I make a new f file or folder called Flash, so it will be more organized and easier to access. Once you have that, you drag the Shockwave Flash object into the folder that you just made. I already have it there. Once it's there, you can disconnect your PSP from your computer, and then you go to the internet browser, and you go to the PSP on the offline launcher. launcher. Then you click select, And it's easier because you don't have to type in anything. You just find where the folder is. So you go to Common. Then we go to Flash, because that's the folder we put it in. And then that's our file. Make sure that it's a .swf, because it will need to be that to work. Click X, and then... When it asks you, do you want to run the plugin embedded in the stage, you click yes, and then the game starts. The games on the PSP will run slower than it would wor run on the computer, but they would still work and still fun to play. Let me show you how it works. Start. And then you can do everything that you do on the computer, just it's going to be a little slower. There, I made that one. And that's the end of this tutorial. Goodbye.